Hello everyone from Chelsea Fan TV. This is the walk of shame. We just lost 4-1 against Newcastle. We've lost 4-1 against Newcastle away. This video is definitely getting copyrighted. Uh, but I think it's important to see that as away fans we've made this journey all the way to Newcastle. Some people have come from London, some people have come from up north, either way. And you know, we spend all this money and we come out with an expectation. Fucking 4-1. What a load of rubbish. Uh, so that's why I wanted to record this as we're walking downstairs because, you know, we go down and we do the fan cams, but it is depressing. It's fucking shit, you know? And, and I, I really feel bad for some of the players. I feel bad for Pochettino as well because I think, I think that he's going to get a lot of stick for this, but I just don't think that the players individually did enough. You know, don't get me wrong, there were some okay performances. I thought I thought Kukure was okay. Uh, you know, defensively fucking four goals again. You know, it's just criminal, guys. Criminal. You cannot get away with conceding four goals. Two matches in a row, eight goals in total. And don't get me wrong, when you're scoring it when you're scoring four or five goals in a game, you can get away with it like Man City. But we're not that team. We are just not that team. Um, so, you know, I'm really disappointed, guys. I thought, coming into this game, I thought we'd win. I was really confident. I said 2-0. I predicted a clean sheet. We've got such a great group of defenders. I just don't understand why we can't keep a clean sheet. And for me, this was the time to beat Newcastle. This was it. It wasn't another time. So... I'm really, really gutted. Um, and, you know, the first half, I think we can comfortably say we were the better team. But then come the second half, things just went to shit. I mean, some of the yellow cars as well, what are these referees doing? You know, I'm looking at these yellows and they're just so soft. I understand the yellows are yellow, sometimes it's a foul, but... You know, I didn't understand why Reese James got sent off. Maybe if there was a replay or something, then... Psh, I could have seen it over again, but to me it was a soft second yellow. Uh, should have never been sent off in the first place. And now we've got another player banned against Brighton. Uh, as far as I'm aware, Kukurea is also banned against Brighton as well. <sighs> you know, Madueke coming on for six minutes at the end. Uh, what's that going to do for his confidence, you know? So, Boha didn't really do anything, but he didn't get any service either. So. I'm looking at this Chelsea team. I've still got hope. I'm going to go down here. I've still got hope, definitely got hope. But for me, yeah, we're, we're going to record in here. We, we do Chelsea Fan TV. Sorry? Chelsea Fan TV. We, we were here last season. We, we went to the stadium. Yeah, sure. that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, so. Fucking. I mean. <laughs> And, and the Newcastle fans are so shameless, you know. I'm not here to give you some massive analysis. It's just, it's just an idea of what we go through as, as fans to get to the game. Yes, we can! We fucking did it last year! What? What? Lewis! Yeah, personally, mate, when you try and match a team with the best home record in England, what they're going to do, they're going to kill you, personally, mate. When you go man to man, they're going to kill you, mate, personally. And I personally think we need to go a bit more defensive when we come to teams like places like this. Get the fans behind them, mate, they kill you. 30 minutes, Paul Merson called it. He turned around and said, if you find it, silence the fans within 30 minutes, that's gonna that's gonna be out for you. Killer man. Yeah. Killer. Personally, mate, we came here, 
about the Chelsea boys after the City game, after the after the Tottenham game. We were we were not on the front foot. We came here. We thought, oh, do you know what? We beat City. We drew a City. We beat Tottenham. What we're gonna do? We're gonna come here and come on the front foot. It's not gonna happen. Once we get them on the front foot and the fans on side, there's 13 men against 12, and then obviously restraints down as well. If restraints when re when restraints went off, restraints went off. Went down to 10. 10 against 13. We're never gonna win. We're never gonna win. Thank you, mate. Always a pleasure. Cheers, mate. Well, we heard it first. Let's just see what let's see what John has to say. John. John, what, you, what, what did you think about it today, mate? Me? I mean, I was sat near you. I could was, see you were gutted. It was completely lacklustre, wasn't it? There was no fight. There was nothing. I mean, we started off the game all right, but after that, it was just like nothing. I mean, we come all this way for no reason whatsoever, really. How much do you spend? <laughs> Me? Yeah. Three or four hundred pounds. Joke. For the three hundred four hundred pounds to lose four one. But not just yeah. the, the fact that we lost, the way that we lost. Yeah, well I think Pochettino got it a bit wrong, didn't he really, to be honest. Yeah. I think the substitutes but the three substitutes was a big key point. He brought on three subs. For for what? Replacing replacing the same thing with uh, with the same thing, right? Frustrating. What do you think, Don? I'll be real, I reckon international break has killed us and like even the first half we weren't too good was we? And then we come out the second half, it was even fucking worse. Like what more is there to say really? Like You feel let down? A little bit, but uh, this new Chelsea, you kind of expect it, you know what I mean? This ain't Roman Abramovich era no more, like Todd Bowley brought in a load of new players, like a load of young players, no experience. Well, little experience you know what I mean so it is what it is like after we uh, beat Tottenham and then at that um, like the 4-4 against Man City you expect us to maybe go on and like get something out of this game you know what I mean especially with Newcastle and they've got like fucking what 10-11 players out you know what I mean so it is what it is really thank you buddy you have a good one cheers alright let's